Good morning. I'm John Perkins with the Opening Market Minute. Soybeans are higher so far on Thursday. For the third day in a row, the USDA reported a new U.S. soybean export sale, this time to unknown destinations, half for this marketing year, half for next marketing year, bringing the three-day total to more than 400,000 tons, most of that for new crop delivery. The weekly numbers, though, weren't great, below average, even if China was the big weekly buyer. Corn's up modestly. Weekly export numbers, not all that great there either as we head into this final quarter of the current marketing year. Past that, corn continues to watch planning activity, late planning activity in the Midwest and Plains, expecting some near-term delays. And wheat's higher, supported by short covering and some global crop weather concerns. Live and feeder cattle are mixed, waiting for the rest of the week's direct cash cattle business. Trade's been light to moderate so far this week, generally steady to lower prices. Box beef was sharply lower again on Wednesday afternoon. And hogs are mixed, mostly modestly higher. Weekly export numbers not great there either. And the trade is keeping an eye on the wholesale market. Pork was firm yesterday, but it's lost a lot of ground recently. I'm John Perkins with the Opening Market Minute.